Well, this event is a little different. Welcome back to Random Events in History. Let's go to October 28th, 1943, to talk about the Philadelphia Experiment. Before you give me too much crap, I know it's pretty much accepted as a hoax, but I thought it was intriguing anyway. So let's begin. Allegedly, around October 28th, 1943, an experiment was carried out on the Cannon-class destroyer ship, the USS Eldridge, in Philadelphia, Pennsylvania. The experiment was mainly based on unified field theory. In other terms, the researchers who took part of this experiment were trying to render the USS Eldridge invisible by using massive electrical generators to bend and refract light around the ship. The story's origins date to 1955, when Morris K. Jessup, an astronomer with a master's in astrology, received a letter from a Carlos Allende. In the letter, he claimed to be on a merchant ship nearby the Elridge when he and other crew members with him on October 28, 1943, witnessed it turn almost completely invisible. But that's the normal part of the story. Supposedly, green fog replaced the location of the ship, and the crew members started getting nauseous. Once the ship reappeared, part of the sailors seemed to be phased into part of the ships. Others went insane, and some supposedly were turned inside out. Lots of other alleged side effects took place, but it gets less and less believable the longer it goes on. Stories also exist that the ship not only vanished, but was transported a few hundred miles away to Norfolk, Virginia, then vanished back to Philadelphia. Another follow-up story involved a crew member simply vanishing in the middle of a bar fight after he got off the ship. There are other follow-up stories, and just reading up on them, you can tell they are simply bizarre. The letter recounting the experiment was sent with little to no actual proof, and as time has gone on, there is still no substantial evidence. Considering the Elridge was sold as scrap in 1999, it's most likely just going to stay as the myth that has grown around it. In 1984, a science fiction film was released with a basis circling around the urban legend. A sequel was released nine years later, and a television film Reconception was released nine years after that. The legend is still alive and well, it seems. The Philadelphia Experiment is an infamous and popular urban legend that still stands the test of time. Whether it in some way happened that fateful day in 1943 is still disputed by die-hard theorists and will continue to do so for a very long time. Thank you for watching, and thank you for your continued support. I hope to see you next time for another random event in history.